Now, I'm recording this video under, um, under the presumption you've seen Cyberpunk at your of, co um, of course. Um, it, it's better than the game, don't at me. <laughs> um, so, we've all seen videos at this point, well, as, as of this uh, um, point of recording. And honestly, from what I got, um, let's get to the meat and bones, Walt Weiss. Um, David, he got too cocky. And I honestly think that's ironically really human for what became of him or what he chose to do to his body and honestly he was really young he was 17 he chose um to follow the opposite of main's path well the op um, opposite of main's um final request um which was to run um instead he chose to fo um be like me and follow me and you have to um take an account that as harsh as it sounds david's not special he was just an ordinary high school well college student um well frankly was smart enough to go to this um high standard high um what <laughs> college and he was an outcast for it he quit because it, um he was an outcast so he sought um a place where he could get um accepted finding um a place where he could be valued as um as a member is more um, meaningful than a place where you get treated like trash. It, it, it's a value of principle. It's a value of self-respect. What, I mean, what else was David supposed to do? Kiss, um, kiss, um, honestly, You're not worth my time, ass. <laughs> like, no. N not after his mom died. Not after they disrespected her. Me was like a father to him. Um, after his mom died. Even though he tried to kill him. Um, his first meeting. But... That's how life rolls sometimes. But Main died a, a tragic hero. Am I? I wish it, um, I had more to say um, of this, but this is unscripted. So sorry for um, the messiness. But tell me if you like um, unscripted videos um, as equal um, as scripted videos. Um, and honestly, that was his downfall because he was too perfect. He was the exception. And I feel like we've all felt like, um, we're the exception at one point in our lives. So I felt that David was... Um, human in that sense and the most um, um, comparison I can think of is that I wasn't gifted um, in elementary school fourth grade and 
I saw this straighter girl um got A's um all year except for this one time where she got a B. Now she burst out crying because she, um she got a B and I didn't understand why. Now I didn't understand why it stuck to me uh, um, this many years later, but I think um, the pressure, the labels, um, the everything really got to her. What I'm trying to get at is that we've all been faded. We've all turned our backs down um, people because we we um we've been focusing too much on our goal at the time. I'm not saying um don't know if this is happening to you right now. Don't know if this happened to you yesterday. Don't know what if it'll happen tomorrow. But we've all been dated. And we've all chosen to, I want to say, um, side effect, we've all chosen to withdraw um, with advice. With what advice? Um, I don't know, you tell me. What is the advice? In the case of David, it was more enhancements um and with more enhancements it, well with more enhancements um we see he flew too close to this um to the sun well in the in his case he flew um he rose to high at the corporate ladder literally and it cost him all his friends lives well almost all his friends lives including best girl and I guess Lucy too and we all knew David was doomed from the start just by um, seeing that opening, like, <laughs> it was kind of spo um, spoilery, um, at the end, um, with, um, that, um, bullet through, um, his head, <laughs> but we knew he was gonna make it to the tower, but at, at what cost? But you have to ask yourself, did he really make the right choice? Did you really make the right choice? You never know. That's, that's what I think bothers most of us. What's alive? Um, well, we're only human and I think David as much as um as um cybernetic um enhanced as he was he died human and we never knew um no if um what he did was right or wrong we'll never know if our decisions that impact our lives greatly are right or wrong all jokes aside, cyberpunk, um, to me, was a cautionary tale um, of what happens when you get too focused into something, albeit your job, your homework, your whatever. You, um, your 
you uh, hours you spend on YouTube. Like it all takes some um, some time to balance, and there's nothing wrong with that. 